Hello guys, Average here. Today we're going to make an absolute worst possible car. And make it working, of course. Uh, so, of course, we're going for hatchback. Uh, this one's 2.6 meters. Uh, And it has to be relatively new. I think we're going for a 2009 body. Okay, dump the quality back to where it belongs. Make it out of regular steel. What's what's the cheapest? Well, it's cheaper than monocoque. Yikes. Regular steel. Uh, which one's going to be cheaper? We're going for front wheel drive. So, front transverse. Uh, about suspension. This is going to be tricky. No Macperson strat. Why? Why there is no Macperson? Ah, uh, coil. Or... Leaves are cheaper. It's going to be absolutely terrible. Inline tree. With uh, one liter displacement. Uh... Make it an absolute square if it's possible. Cast iron. Uh, well, shreds are cheaper. Cast iron. None of this, none of this, none of this. Is there anything that costs less? No. Make it out of trash. Uh, lower the compression ratio because I don't think we're even going to start the engine at this rate. We will not turbocharge it. Okay, so single carp costs us. About 150. What about the cheapest injection? Oh god. No. Multi point EFI? No, it's going to be single carp. Yep. Minus 15 on quality. I increase the fuel mixture because it's probably gonna knock. Uh, regular fuel. Cast lock exhaust. Uh, 
I think we have to put the, the cat. The cheapest one, of course. Uh, no muffler and regular second muffler. It does have a valve float. Can we lower the quality by a bit? I don't think so. Now we just have to decrease the RPM limit. We're running at 81 octane, so we can actually increase the compression or just add the turbo to it. Okay. Dump the RPM limit even lower. Okay. We're done with this. It's beautiful. Gorgeous. How does it sound like? What's the difference? Is it like a two and four door? We are going for a two door. As for the color, we will go for... Gorgeous. Uh, we won't be sitting here. We're just using the regular as lights. Get bigger. Give it a uh, nice suck. Of the number plates. Okay, this 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 one. Gorgeous. Copy this, went over here, uh, turn it over, make it shorter. Gorgeous. Okay. Uh, for the badging, of course, it's going to be T. Put it somewhere here.
copy the indicators. What's happening here? Okay, as for the... Door handle. It's gonna get this one. Tilt it a bit. Get rid of the chrome. Is there anything chrome here? Yes, it's this. Some mirrors. Great. A uh, fuel cap. This. For the tail lights, uh, these are good enough. Let's fucking put them on. Turn over. Change this to something less translucent. Uh, put our number plate on something here. Make it all green. As for the number plate, we were going for this one, I think. Make it flat. a bit higher and of course put some indicators on this turn them 90 degree I change the color to whatever white there is Great. Also put the, the same batch here. I think we have to use the 3D modeling here. It actually looks... Uh... No, it doesn't. Uh, some some fucking exhaust. No, A straight pipe looks too good for this car. Uh, we're going for this one. Make it smaller. Perfect. Uh, am I done with this? Probably, yes. Front wheel drive, manual, four speed, because it's not going to reach... It's not going to reach 100, I think. Uh, high spacing between uh, gears. Open diff. Uh, Dump the quality down, radial tires, uh, we might go for hard long life. 
minus 15 on quality make it out of steel uh, 14 inch uh, wheels are good enough decrease the tire tire diameter to 600 We're going to give it drums. No under tray, minus 15 on quality here. Basic interior, no entertainment, it doesn't deserve five people inside. No power steering, no ABS, no safety features. Minus quality on every single thing here. Standard springs. Uh, twin tube passive sway bars. Everyone hates it. I'm fine with this. doesn't understeer or oversteer so well front brake force is low all brake force is low can I make it cheaper at least okay no it's impossible to make it good keep the drums as low as possible what about the drivetrain? Oh, it actually can go a bit further. Maybe... Yeah, give it 5 speed. Does it help with the fuel? No, 5 speed is the best here. We're done with the car. That's all we had to do. I wonder how does it work in DMNG. Okay, uh, also have to... I might go back to the... I really don't want to... Give it a wishbone. Okay, it's much lighter. Torsion beam. Not bad. Uh, it's still terrible. Does oversteer now? Hundred to zero in nearly hundred meters. It doesn't stop at all. Okay, 
I made a few tweaks. Uh, first of all, I changed the the front suspension setup to double wishbone. I still have no idea why it doesn't allow me to put McPherson struts in the front. And also, uh, I lowered it by, by a bit. I mean, by a lot, actually. I forgot to change the quality of suspension. It's look, it looks like a car now. As for the markets, and no one would ever buy it. It's just impossible. And now for the interesting part, it's way below five grands. So it's good. Uh, it has terrible fuel economy, uh, mostly because of carburetor setup. As for the points, it's it's actually not that bad. Although it has to be at 3000 RPM just to go as fast as 110 kilometers an hour, it is practical. I mean, uh, it's, well, it's still terrible, terrible braking, no safety features, no safety quality, okay, let's export it now, name it, uh, Dollars. That could. Last pick up the car. And export it to BeamNG.